Hi, I'm Tony. Welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video about the Guyane G Dakar Gore-Tex boots. With a name like G Dakar Gore-Tex, it's probably pretty obvious all along that these were never going to be race boots with toe sliders. No, these are new for 2021 adventure boots with the Gore-Tex membrane that keeps your feet dry. They have a genuine leather upper that will mark and it'll age as you wear them in, giving them a nice patina as you go along. The stiff sole on these boots combines lugs for grip when walking on loose surfaces here at the heel and on this side of the sole, and then a lower profile section here where your feet are more likely to be in contact with the foot pegs. The upper is reinforced with plastic inserts at the heels and the toes, and then there's a plastic shin guard. It's worth noting that this plastic guard isn't rated under CE to provide protection against impacts. That's an optional test as part of CE. There's a rubberized overlay to protect the upper against damage from the gear lever, and it also makes gear shifts more comfortable on your feet. And then there's the bracing that protects your ankles against damaging twisting forces. It's quite a simple arrangement, but it's really quite effective. This plastic brace here is attached on either side of the boot, and then it closes with one of the strap fasteners to wrap it around your ankle and keep it secure. It stops that kind of flexing movement that you don't want. You don't want your ankle to be moving in this direction while still allowing the flexing that you do want in this direction so you can walk and you can change gear. That fastener is the upper of two clasp closures. They're both aluminium buckles and they have a simple closure that just clicks shut. The top strap here offers 60 millimeters of adjustment and then there's 40 millimeters of adjustment on that bottom strap. The top of the boot then closes up with a large Velcro panel. Once you've got the boot undone, that large gusset section just behind there makes them really easy to get on your feet and it also keeps your feet dry. These boots have a Gore-Tex membrane inside them, which is widely regarded as the most effective waterproof membrane around, especially when it comes to breathability. I've not worn these boots personally in the rain, but I have every faith in Gore-Tex's performance when it's wet after years of wearing Gore-Tex boots. And there's another couple of factors in the favor of these boots as well. Gore-Tex offers a lifetime warranty for the waterproofing of their boots, which is the really good first step of backup. And there's also the fact that these boots have passed the water resistance test as part of the CE testing program. Again, that's an optional test like the impact test I spoke about earlier. And there's plenty of waterproof boots that aren't tested in this way, but the WR mark on the CE label for these boots shows they are tested to be waterproof. So while we're talking about CE, let's cover the rest of the information on these boots when it comes to the testing. The G Dakar Gore-Tex boots meet the higher level two in all four compulsory categories of the test. It should be pretty obvious they're full height boots, so they've got that bit of the test nailed and the higher level two there. They're also level two then for the three technical tests, and that's resistance to abrasions, to cuts, and to lateral crushing forces. The WR mark on there is the bit that shows they're waterproof, and incidentally, that's also where you would see either an IPS or an IPA mark if the boots were rated to give impact protection at the shins or ankles. It's IPS for shins and it's IPA for ankles. The insoles for these boots are really comfortable and supportive, and they're also removable. So you can replace them if you need something thicker to improve the fit or also if they wear out over time. The G Dakar Gore-Tex boots, which were launched in late summer 2021 with an RRP of £319.99, are available in Euro sizes 41 to 48. That's size 7 through to 13 for us British riders. Initially, they're available in either this black colour or a brown version. I found these boots to be a decent addition to the options that are available for people who want adventure boots. In the past, I've reviewed Guyane boots and I found them to be a little bit narrow, but that's not been the case with this model. They feel very regular in terms of their fit. The most popular option in the adventure boot market at the moment are the big rivals for these boots, the CD Adventure 2 Gore-Tex, which have built up a really enviable reputation over recent years. It will be hard for these boots to overcome those city boots, but they do offer a decent alternative and they're well worth a look before you make a final decision on which adventure boots you want to go with. I hope that tells you everything you wanted to know about the Guyane G Dakar Gore-Tex boots, but if there is anything you'd like to ask or to add, then please pop a comment below. Thanks for watching.